Come on, Bryce. Come on. You've got to be kidding me. But, but, but I'll be thrown in jail. I'm not legal. <clears throat> um, uh, my friend just turned up. I think he can help. I love you. Screw your wife, honey. This is for real. Jesus H, Nico. I need a tranquilizer. Something strong. Oh, man, I am cold. <laughs> Enjoying your new life in the land of opportunity, Dan? This is no time for jokes, buddy. Uh-uh. No, sorry. I'm in real trouble, Nico. Real trouble. Bryce is getting blackmailed. About what? About me! Okay, that's not good. Did he find out any information about Darko Brevich yet? No, but he's working on it. You've got to help me. Got to? Huh. How? We're going to warn these bastards off. Come on! Ah. Uh. Go get us a car, sweetie. I want something big and awful and intimidating. All right, hon. The meat is on Walnut Way in Northwood. Yuck! I can't even imagine where that is. I hope you know. I can find it. Have I told you about the first time I met Bryce? It was a foam party at Hercules. I was high on X and youth and beauty and I was dancing like I've never danced before. I was slave to the beat and a god on the floor. Sure. Then it happened. Out of nowhere, I was struck. I saw his face through the bubbles and I knew every beautiful boy in Algonquin was there that night, but he was the only one for me. I thought to myself, that middle-aged, closeted, married, self-hating hypocrite, he's the man of my dreams. That's what people are trying to take away. That's love. I wanted to speak to him, not his rent boys. Listen, you're going to speak to your boss and tell him to back off. <laughs> if that's the way you want to play it, fine. Bryce will be all over Visa News tomorrow morning. You know what? Maybe the best way to get a message to your boss is for me to send him your heart. Yeah, tough guy. How'd you like that? Dmitry Raskolov only asks once. Your lover's career is over. Fucking Dimitri. Me in the back. Is that what you have to do to make the list? No. You 
came after Rome, destroyed the home and business he had worked hard to make. We're getting these guys. Can you please shut up until this is done? Thank you. All right, the guys are dead. I'll take you back to your place. I don't want to die! So we were just meant to scare them? Well, that didn't work out so good, did it? At least they can't tell Dimitri about the meeting or go to the papers. Dimitri is too much of a rat to go to the media himself. The information he has on Bryce is too valuable. You think? It would kill Bryce if he didn't have his career? Maybe he should have thought about that when he started dating you. Not that there's anything wrong with dating you. Your choice is your choice, man. But he should have thought about who he was before getting elected on the family values ticket. He preaches homosexuality as evil. It's insanity. He's a hypocrite, and it was only a matter of time before someone like Dimitri tried to capitalize. Shit. I'll shut up now. You don't need me telling you about your life. I don't normally talk this much. I'm your friend, and I will try to help. Look after yourself, yeah? I hope Dimitri and his people back off now. Thank you so much, Nico. I'll speak to you soon. 